Welcome to Made in OC Small Business Saturday, where we highlight local Orange County small businesses who are living their dream and serving our community. Today we feature Sienna Marlene Garcia, owner and designer for Le Florette by Marlene. I actually grew up here in Santa Ana, went to Jefferson um, Elementary, McFadden Intermediate, and studied from high school. I was born and raised here and still continue to live here. I love the city, it's amazing. It's changed a lot throughout the years and I thought, you know, why not open my own business here? My business is flowers, flower arrangements. I also make basket designs. It's really fun. It's honestly, it's whoever comes up to my door, whoever comes and calls me. So my job is to make, you know, their imagination come reality. Cielo helped me so much in the starting program that they had. You know, the first time I, I, I enrolled, I said, wow, this is so much information I didn't know. I actually had to drop out because I was focused on two jobs. But then I'm at the, like, there's a, there was a little thing in me that said, I think I can. And so when they announced it again, I did it. I went and I changed it up. So I changed my plan a little bit. I tweaked it. I asked more questions and they've helped me so much. They've been really open. But I want to say thank you for everyone in the Cielo community. How I started actually began as a hobby. Originally, I wanted to be a wedding planner. And I just decided to focus on one little thing in that. And by doing that, I decided to take side classes of floor design. At the time though, my brother actually got in a car accident. So I decided to stop working. He was there in the hospital for three months. I didn't want to stop seeing him. I didn't want him to feel lonely. So I decided to continue these classes, yet still go and you know see him, and yet pay my bills. So having no job, going to classes, trying to have a feel of being a little bit happy in a very tragic kind of moment. And I think that kind of pushed me to kind of stay positive, even though sometimes it was very difficult. Even if I'm a small business right now, I'm not making this as a chance for me to become rich, but you know, to find something for my future, either for me, for my future kids, for my own family, my you know brothers, my mom, for that reason. So if you're starting a business, you don't want to give up. Take notes, read, reread. It's very challenging, it is, it's hard. And if for one slight minute you feel that, oh my gosh, I'm not worth this. I am just so tired, I'm not, no, you are. You're worth it and continue to do it.